What is up guys, Mr. Berries here, and welcome to Layers of Fear. Now, in case you guys do not know, this is a psychological horror game where you are an artist or a painter, and you're basically just exploring an abandoned mansion. I didn't get too much from the description of the game, but it looked amazing, and I watched a couple of minutes of someone play it, just enough to get a feel of the game, and it looks amazing, and I think you guys are going to love this, because oh, I'm so psyched to play it. So, psychological horror, in case you guys don't know, is more like it's your mind making everything scary in the atmosphere. So, without further ado, let's jump right into this game. So, like I said before, I don't know much about, like, who you are or what you are. I think you're just a painter, and so I think the paintings are gonna play a big role in this game, so I think we really have to... Pay attention to those. Oh, God. The torment I have to endure. I still hear the scratching in my head. Deeper and deeper, and my hands cut so many times on broken bottles, each night drowning in a cold sweat. There is a way, a way to bring back what life took from me, the only precious thing. Subtitles are a little bit off, but that's okay. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sister. Okay. So yeah, the subtitles looked a little bit off, but here we are. So I don't know what that guy was talking about. Okay guys, what's up? We're back here. I had to fix some lag, but I think it's, for the most part, it's a lot better now. So now, let's take a look at this starting area here. By the way, I love the way this game looks. It's amazing. Jeez. Look at this picture. This lady's knocked on the ground. That guy doesn't even care. Girls are kind of like, eh, whatever. We got this baby, <laughs> this baby guy getting carried away by an eagle. He doesn't look too happy about that. He's also, he is also peeing. That's great. Got a dog muzzle here. Old-fashioned dog muzzle. I take it we're back in a, in a later time. Earlier time. I got a note here. I didn't see this. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. <laughs> okay. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of rodent infestations of any kind and, uh, and us such decided not to act further than a prophylactic spraying. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from your lawyers. Our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pest Pacification Company. Okay, then. Let's open this up here. What we got in here? An artist triumphs. Stitched out gallery opening wows critics. Some call him the new Caravaggio. Others compare him to Evan Van Eyck. And one awestruck critic who wished to be renamed remain unnamed went as far as to invoke the spirit of the great leonardo anyway you slice it the exhibition proved an immense success parts scratched out distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of renaissance influences and more progressive techniques the artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiance looking stunning in her black gown blank revealed us to us exclusively that the company are endeared expecting expecting what those parts are scribbled out which is weird now when i was trying to fix the lag there wasn't anything in there. I know that. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop just like you asked, though I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. So it appears that this is like his workshop, and it appears that he has like a butler or something. And also, it appears that he's a really great artist, as the letter so said. Now we got this. Longdall Mufgar Av 7C Popker. Popkill? Popkill. Something. I don't know. I can't read that. 
No, something also broke in here. Wine bottle. Do we have anything in here? I don't know if we have anything in here. I already looked in these areas. I didn't find anything in these cabinets. I can open them and check. I can't open that one. I can't crouch either, but I think I can sprint. I can sprint. It's good to know. What's in here? Oh, okay. Just a closet. Can I turn a light on? Oh, I can. I didn't think I could turn that on. I didn't know that. That's good to know. We can turn on the lights. Turn that off just because... I don't need it on right now. Is there any... Oh, I can. I have a note here. Point. Red for the green. Bunch is 25. Air freshener is 50 packs. Apples, 10. Key, 10 key. Booze, 5, 10, 30. Okay, so it appears we have a bit of a drinking problem here. Or maybe that our problem just got worse as... Whatever. If anything bad happens... Something bad happened. So it appears that the key is also in the office. What's in here? Okay, I don't want to go down there just yet. Sorry, there is a bit of a lag. Like I was saying. But it's not bad. It's not too bad. Is there a light anywhere? Oh, so I can't see my reflection a little bit. Ooh, perfume. Okay. Perfume, that me. So there's probably a lady. Oh, there's the light switch. Can I look at myself? Just a little bit. Okay. So I don't look like too bad of a man. And we got another note here. One below knee prosthetis. How the hell did they fuck you up, Link? The... I don't know what that says, but somehow he got messed up. And this bathroom's slightly flooded. Now, I feel like I'm going to save the basement for... Okay, I stepped on some glass. I feel like I'm saving the basement for last, because I don't like the basement. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Oh, that scared me for a second. Rat traps, okay. Apparently we have a pretty bad infestation. Let's leave that light on. Now I will, I'll try the door, but I think we need the key for it. And I'm correct in assuming so. So let's go up. You know, oh my gosh, that's a creepy painting. Did this guy paint all these? Okay. Oh! Okay. That scared me. I'll, I'll admit to that. What's this? Oh gosh. The music stopped. What? No, 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 no. Good night. Turn off, please. I don't like it. Thank you. Okay, oh, that mirror's broken. Maybe someone was upset. I'm sorry, I don't like that old music. Just because it, it sounds like... It doesn't sound like anything good would happen to that music even though it wasn't scary music it i just don't like it i'd rather have this atmospheric piano music playing galactic's grand opening in flames disastrous fire at the new department store kills dozens injures hundreds the long-awaited opening of the galactic department store turned into hell on earth when the buildings wiring burst into flames the ensuing panic force made 
forced many of the visitors to gather by the emergency exits, which in the end turned into overcrowded death traps. By the end of the day, the catastrophic disregard for safety procedures claimed the lives of 37 people, leaving 243 injured. The police is currently conducting an investigation as to who is responsible for this disaster. The owner of the Galactic, Ronald Sheffield, refused to comment on the matter. Extraordinary cure of a cough. Nightmare Hal and uh, Dear Son, I have recently suffered much from a most violent cough proceeding from a tickling in my throat. Otherwise, with no remedy out of any, I resorted I could all lie. Alright, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Sorry about that. I don't think the cough really had much to do with it, though. Looks like there's a scroll or bandages. Oh, I can view them. Okay. I didn't think I could. Can I view everything? I don't think so. Open this up. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Apparently, you guys don't care too much for that. Anything in here worth viewing? Can I hide? Can I hide in here? No, this is an amnesia. Can't hide in the closet. Now I have multiple ways I can go already. And it looks like I have a note I can view here. Yes. Little Vinny and Partners got a rat problem? Call us now and lag it to bat it. What? Fast, efficient, and discreet. Okay. There's a lot of things referencing rats in this. I don't know if that's anything really important. What? Looks like something got knocked down. Okay. Well, this is a nice and cozy place, isn't it? True story. Behind the picture of Dorian Gray, was it true all along? As astounding investigation, investigation Professor A. Alistar Raul Malmax from the Mr. Miskatonic University uncovers the secrets of this magnificent work by one of the all-time greatest writers, Oscar Wilde. Was Dorian Gray real? Did he have an insight into the esoteric? Is the novel filled with encrypt clues for the initiate, initiated read to find out? Okay. Is that me? I don't think that's me, but... Am I supposed to remember that name or anything? And also, was there a light switch? There is. Okay. So this got knocked over somehow. By who? Or by what is the question? Okay, either that got turned on. Okay. I think we got matches in there. Got a note in here. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some hard times right now. I really do. That's why I agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place. For old times' sake, I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be... Little Red Riding Hood to be so... Something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare feel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There's no way in hell I'm using this and I already regret agreeing to payment in advance. Please get your shit together. The old pal, Liam Brickstall, Papyrus Publishing's lieutenant. So we got the key. But what what was he submitting? Oh, just broke a bottle. What, what was he submitting? It was something about a kid's story that was... Oh, so was that what he drew? Oh, and that probably scared the kids. Oh, okay. Oh my, what? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could definitely see why this guy was, uh... Got that letter submitted to him. Oh, that's a little bit creepy, too. This is all just fantastic. I could definitely see why that guy would be, uh... Yelled at. Now, I have more rooms I can go into... I guess I'll just... Okay. I guess I'll go into this one first. It's a big door, by the way. Okay, so maybe... Maybe I have a kid. Do I have a kid? 
I mean, the room definitely says I do. Maybe this... Okay, I'll leave that light on. What's this? A little toy soldier. Okay. And we got this rattler. That, that looks like a rattler to me. Okay. Little bit... That's just a little bit creepy. What was that? Okay, it looked like eyes. That looked like eyes. I got scared. <laughs> Alright. Locked. Okay. You know, I might as well go in this room. The blood-soaked one that I can't go in. Okay. So it looks like it will be a little guided. What's that? Something's... Oh, I think it's just shadows from the leaves. Okay. These paintings are a little bit creepy, too. I don't know if I like them. I know I don't like them. So we got this door open. Oh, okay. That'll make for a good screenshot. Alright. This seems to be my painting room. As it appears. Drop books, Reiner, you're professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over over the hump. What's so hard about it? Okay. Sorry if I'm a bit rusty trying to read everything. He has paint all over the place, though. Looks like... Hmm, this is interesting. Definitely interesting. Oh, and a jar full of paintbrushes. Not a jar. A, a case full of paintbrushes. Okay, let's... And then my booze. Okay, may, uh, maybe I have a, b a bit of an alcohol problem. Just a bit. Judging by all the stuff I have. Okay. That all seems to be normal. I'll pull that down in a second. Okay, I need a key for that. So I guess... We'll go ahead and... Okay. That's scary. Get it right this time. Okay. First p few strokes and everything's okay. Am I gonna paint? There's nothing really there to see, is there? So maybe I go down into the basement? I don't want to, but... Oh man, why do I play games like this? Oh gosh. Okay, what what is that? That doesn't look good at all. Get it right this time. Oh! Okay, and when I said psychological, I think it it's psychedelic is what it was supposed to be. Psychedelic, but it is psychological too. It is very much psychological, as you can see. Hallways changing, that's the epiphany of psychological horror. It's the same painting, by the way. Okay, looks like we have pipes, so... I like some of that. Can I go through here? Oh! Okay. I'll be on my way, then. Oh my goodness, this is... Okay. We got some more spilt wine there. That's nice. Um... Going in circles. Okay then. I've played plenty of games where I walk around in circles. Wouldn't be anything different. Okay, screw off, mate. I don't want to. I don't want to hear you. Okay. Oh, I can light them. Oh, what? What? Oh. Four eight five. Okay. Four eight five. 
And it appears to be that that's that noise is coming from the chest. So let's try to open it. Four eight five. Four. Eight. Definitely coming from the chest. Five. It's open. The past holds back. Look closer. Okay, so this is him marrying his wife, eh? Eh? I, I, I normally don't say eh. I'm not Canadian. Oh! Never forget. Never forget Valley Forge. Never forget. Never forget the uh, history class. Okay. Never forget the Alamad. You guys know what I'm talking about. If, you, if you've taken the class, it's the Alamo. The Alamo. Never forget the Alamo. Oh, what am I saying? I don't even care anymore. Okay, I wasn't expecting this. I was expecting just to go into the basement, but I'm actually fine with this because I don't want to go in the basement. I, I don't. I don't want to go in the basement one bit. But I know I have to. Oh, jeezum. That's a little messed up. I'm gonna be. I can't go into those. Oh. Okay. I can't see a thing, guys. I'm just as blind as you right now. That scared the crap out of me. Okay, okay. Holy crap. Holy crap. What? Ow! What the heck? What the heck? Okay, let's get out of here, guys. Let's get out of here. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'm, I'm in here. That was the deal. Oh, and the doll's there. Okay. I'm. Uh, <laughs> oh, what was that? Jeez, I'm. That sound. Oh, man. It was. Sweat dripped down my arm, which is why I went, ah, uh, because I could uh, feel the sweat because I'm scared. Okay. Oh, just... Oh. Let's just go. Let's just go. This room looks more inviting than the last one. What? What? Rats? Okay. Oh my gosh. That noise. Bart Miller, Sispen Dippingen's Profilio Yoga. Um. Oh! Jeez. Okay. That's great. That's that's amazing. You got me. You got me really good. Okay. Let's move on, shall we? What is that? What is, I don't know what that is. I don't care what it is. I'm scared. Let's get out of here, guys. Let's get out of here. Oh my goodness. Okay, a bookshelf. I don't think there's anything in there. Okay. I wonder if there's anything I'm missing, like clues or whatnot. And also, what is going on? Oh no. Please no. That's one thing I don't like in games like this. She's been at it again earlier in the day. 
Oh, September. She's been at it again. Earlier in the day, I found more of her reviews, little notes stuck to one of my latest paintings. Some of the most scathing, hateful shit I've ever read about my work. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. For all she knows me well enough to know what I really gets to me. This can't believe she could use this against me. Worst thing is when I confronted her about it, she claimed she both written. She hadn't written any of them. And I can't tell her handwriting. Jesus. Does she really hate me that much, or is it, or is her mind starting to slip? I just don't know what to do anymore. This hallway's shorter. Ooh, we have decision between two paintings. Let's go to this painting, because I like this one better. Okay, never mind. Guess I'm going to this painting. The longer hallway it is. Oh, okay, it just shuts right behind me. First step is the hardest. Oh, so it's going to get easier. Okay, oh, this is more inviting than the last place. I like this. This is this is better. First step is the hardest, it says. So it's going to get easier then. What? Um, okay. It's locked. Well, I really don't like that noise. Oh. Okay, tell me that was fruit falling. Vegetables and not... Not... Anything else? Whoa! That sounded a lot like a dishonor. No. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. What is going on right now? Holy crap. What is that? First, I look for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. Okay, I got a piece of skin. Booze helped keep my hands steady. So this guy... That's why he had so much booze. He was gonna kill them. Or he did kill them. Okay. Oh, I'm putting it on the painting? Okay. What? First I look for a canvas, not just one of those bad ones. Alright, yep, yeah, sharp as a knife. So we're gonna uncover five more. Is what we have to uncover. Okay, guys. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and end it for this episode. Oh, man, this is amazing so far. Oh, it's great. It's so scary and nothing even bad has happened yet. Alright guys. Well, I really hope you are enjoying this because I'm loving it. As always guys, if you liked the video, make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you want to see some more content. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.